lovely from Tantara in the Katanga, place of many masterpieces. Now, interesting enough here, we have a, a matrix of almost a very thick uh, uh, shadow cut cast. But you'll see there are two different blues. Now I suspect that we are looking at Chatucat and Planchiat. The lighter, the powder blue being the, the Planchiat and the darker blue being the Chatucat. Perched on top of that would be tiny quartz crystals as you see across this rug. And I'm sure under magnification some of them would be um, uh, containing some little sprays of Chatucat needles. From a display point of view, can be displayed on a turntable going around like this. I'll just do it very slow so we can have a really good look. Totally, totally different aspect on this side. There we have almost a, I've called these a bad hair day before, but that would be more typical of the planchiat. Of course, blowing out on the top here, it's, it's a nice uh, a powder blue. And then when we turn it this way over, different aspect of display. Let's have a look at the section with the quartzes. Little botoids of, of Chatucat, of course. And then almost the furry uh, planchiat on top there. Very rich, colorful, busy specimen. And what I was saying earlier about the blowing out the color, there, there you have a pretty accurate indication of the actual color of those planchiat formations. All the way from Tantara in the Katanga, uh, another masterpiece, Chatucat Planchiat. The black material, I suspect, is girthite, could also be heterogenite, actually.